Hello guys and welcome to another project. Just picked her up guys. There it is, check it out. My brand new project. A 1987 Volkswagen Cabriolet. Check it out guys. Very, very good condition. Not much rust. Pretty much no rust really for Canada wise. A um, little bit of rust here, which we're gonna have to fix. Pretty good though. I'm gonna show you everything about it and tell you the plan for it starting right now. So I picked it up for $850. Not bad at all, guys. Not bad at all. Check out inside. So as you can see, guys, even in here, honestly, it's not too bad at all. I'm gonna pop the hood, guys. There is definitely a few problems with it. So on the interior, as you can see, it's honestly not too bad. Um, not too bad at all. Obviously, it's going to need a new roof, so we'll have some videos on that. Uh, currently, it does not run, unfortunately. Okay, let me pop the hood and show you guys in the motor. See, not too, 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 too bad at all, guys. Uh, 1.8 liter. As you can see, this thing is gonna be very, very easy to work on. Cars like this are very easy to work on. Look at all that room, right? So I guess, you know, when you get a car like this, it's kind of hard to decide on like where to start, right? So in my case, for whatever reason, somebody pulled the starter off, see? So the starter is off. The guy I bought the car off of said that the starter was broken uh, probably like five years ago. And they took the starter out and the car has been sitting in a garage for basically the past five years. I noticed I got a box of goodies here that came with the car. And inside of here is the starter. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm actually going to repair that starter or try to and then put it in and see if I can turn the engine over. I noticed another very unfortunate thing about the car. So I noticed there's no antifreeze in any of the pipes they're empty but right about to here so about this level this level here it looks like unfortunately somebody put water in this thing so this is frozen solid this pipe so i'm gonna need most likely a new water pump because it probably froze and cracked it hopefully the block is not cracked it shouldn't be because it seems like the water is just at this level which is below uh, where it would freeze in the block. I looked it up. You can get a new block for like $400 on eBay. So worst comes to worst, we'll be rebuilding the motor. But first, I'm going to put the starter in and try to start it. So that will be episode number two, guys. If you want to see this thing get restored and get put on the road, make sure you subscribe to this channel, guys. So this is episode one of the uh, 1987 Volkswagen Cabriolet, also called a Volkswagen Rabbit, also called a Volkswagen Golf, also called a Volkswagen MK1. A lot of names for this thing. And on the back of it, it says Volkswagen Cabriolet. So many, many names for the same car. Should be a really fun project, good on gas, easy to work on super super cool car i hope you guys join me for this rebuild so right now my neighbor ryan is gonna come over we're gonna push this thing into the garage and i'm gonna bring that starter in the house and that will be the first episode i noticed that this brake is seized up so i'll need new brakes probably all around obviously this one works because we towed the car here with a rope and I used the brakes, obviously, and see, this one got cleaned up. So there's going to be lots to figure out. None of the lights work. Um, otherwise, everything seems good. The windows go up and down. We tried opening the roof. It, it's all super stiff. Going to have to get like WD-40, spray all these. A brand new roof for one of these is $400 on eBay. Not bad, guys not bad at all as far as interior goes pretty cool white interior might eventually reupholster the seats or something but i'm not gonna restore this like 
perfect like I usually do my cars, you know, to like brand new condition. I'm basically just going to make this a nice driving car, but I'm probably not even going to paint it right away. I might eventually get to it and then we'll have videos on that. But the first at least 10 videos are going to be on just getting it on the road. So anyways, I think I showed it pretty good here. Uh, make sure you guys throw me a like and a subscription, guys, and check out episode two, I guess, which will be uh fixing a starter so you don't have to spend 200 dollars on a starter thanks for watching please subscribe till next time guys i love problem solver garage